Hi, everybody. This is Vince Gilligan, executive producer of Breaking Bad. Oh, hi. It's Hello. Bob Odenkirk. Oh, Anna, go ahead. I'm sorry. No, no, Bob. Really, no, no, no. Bob. Uh, it's Anna Gunn here uh, in New Mexico, along with... Moira Wally Beckett, writer, producer, here next to Anna. Hooray. Hooray. Bob? Oh, this is right. We've recorded the pilot and then, for and this. Bob Odenkirk is with us. I'm here. Go, Brian. Go, Aaron. <laughs> and I am Aaron Paul. Jesus, we should just start this one over. <laughs> that was very smoothly. Um, but uh, the reason, by the way, for that little uh, uh, bit of uh, confusion is uh, the funny way we do this is uh, uh, Bob and Aaron and I are in uh, Los Angeles, and uh, Anna and Moira are in uh, Albuquerque as we speak. It's the wonders of technology. See, yeah. this is why people want to become actors, Aaron. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, you know, we but got it was, the scene all set up. Yeah, I, what was so funny was we got into rehearsal and suddenly Aaron, first thing in the morning, is confronted with these <laughs> enormous assets and he was trying to stammer out his lines as best he could. Yeah. <laughs> Just hilarious. Did you, you know, I got. I mean, it was, it was, I got to be honest. Like, I think a lot of people were. We were looking forward to this scene, and um, <laughs> and it was a it was a pretty tough thing to handle. But uh, there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff that we did here that didn't make the that didn't make the cut. What what what, what would that be? Like one, one, <laughs> one for example for example one um, uh, a girl gently placed a bottle of champagne in between her uh, her breasts. And then kind of stood up and poured it into my mouth. That's uh, sk that's oh, a skill. Yeah, that girl. is a skill yeah. on both parts. But I, is that on her resume a special skill? I, I hope so. <laughs> they, these young ladies are they're a sweet bunch of young ladies. They did a they did a very nice job. Everybody here. Did you, uh, uh, Moira? Did you get, uh, get to know any of these ladies? You were here too as well. Uh, Having written uh, this I episode, I got to know the, a couple of them intimately. Yeah, actually. you did. <laughs> yeah, I heard about that. You got a yeah. you got a lap dance. I can't right? talk about it here. <laughs> I did. I got a. I we were auditioning them, and uh, I was volunteered because Johan wouldn't do it, Michelle wouldn't do it. So I was like, I'll fine, I'll do it. I'll I got a lap it. dance. All right. Awesome. Portia. Portia gave me a lap dance. Portia. And they were a nice, nice bunch of uh, young ladies. Yeah, everyone was. They were nice. In, in, all, in, in all honesty, very enthusiastic. Yeah, a very sweet bunch of folks. And uh, you know. What was funny is I think the whole crew, I mean, when they saw the script, everybody was really, really looking forward to this series. Like, yeah! We were, they were all literally there. there. Like, Thanks, Moira. And we then were we there got all there. Day. Oh, my God. And, you know, there were mist. It was not a nice club. No. You know, there were, like, mystery stains everywhere. Yeah. Like, <laughs> and it smelled bad. Mystery stains. I think they, in you know, well, the, the folks enthusiasm waned. Well, Perfectly. yeah, I think it was very typical of uh, strip clubs. I think it's actually, yeah, yeah I think, and there were nice folks who let us shoot yeah, there. And they're so great, we, great folks. There's an uh, establishment yeah. called All Fours, and it's a really awesome. good place. Yes, but by all means, visit it when you're in Albuquerque. You should. <laughs> but seriously, it's called All Fours. I don't know the location, but. Yeah, but yeah. they're a good bunch of folks. Uh, yeah, and some of the dancers came from there. Yeah. And Rodney, of course, wonderful to see Rodney Rush again here, combo. Yeah, he's I great. Think a nice surprise for everybody. Yeah, yeah. and he was definitely, yeah, he was definitely surprised. And, yeah, <laughs> very sweet guy. Characters, I <laughs> yeah. love this gang. I love how Johan, the director of this episode, has uh, has Skinny Pete still way in the background in that last shot, and just, just keep yeah. wandering on forever there. I love, I love how Skinny Pete just vomits mid sentence. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Even really notice. <laughs> it would have been better if it were scripted. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> a great job. He vomited. Let's yeah. use it. <laughs> yes, he is. No, it was scripted. I know. <laughs> no, that was a joke. That was a joke. <laughs> I just love that this is what Jesse used the money on. Yeah. I mean, of course. I love how nobody ever dies completely on Breaking Bad. I know. Uh, no. That's right. Which is good for you, Aaron, when uh, when uh, Jesse gets killed <laughs> off at the beginning of season four. <laughs> Don't get, you're giving it all away. Uh, we'll we'll, we'll, uh, we'll cut that part alert. out. Yeah, cut that out. <laughs> but uh, I, just, I love how you you guys did this. I mean, it's just so complicated and great. I love this shot. Yeah, this. That's a great shot.
Well, Moira, of course, uh, for the folks who don't know, you wrote this episode and did a great job yeah. as always. And then uh, Johan Rink, our uh, crazy uh, Swedish director who we Yay. love, so very talented. Uh, Johan, mm, yeah. who used to be a uh, rock star back in Sweden and is mm -hmm. an uh, insanely talented uh, director, very visually uh, very talented visually, has a great eye, as we say, when we yeah. talk about directors. He directed this. Shot maker. And uh, did, a, did a wonderful job. And it's great and, to hear uh, at the end of a take when he says, that was awesome. I would like to, I would like awesome. to actually introduce somebody. Um, <laughs> oh, we have a, we have a surprise, surprise uh, guest. Surprise guest. Uh, uh, his name is uh, uh, Brian Cranston. Oh, my god! And he plays, he plays <laughs> Walter White. Oh. I should explain. Hello. First, apologies to everyone. <laughs> we're, we're, we're recording this on a Sunday, so and fun. I shut down on weekends. Sorry, I, com I completely forgot. Uh, I have no excuse. Anyway, it's uh, oh. <laughs> it's actually it's it's Oscar Sunday, uh, so I appreciate all you guys uh, yeah. being here and doing this thing. So thank you guys very much. Yeah, usually on Oscar Sunday, I don't help or assist with anything. <laughs> I, I don't participate in any human activities. Oh, just like you're doing now. Yeah. Wow. Look I, at those beautiful oh, feet. The pretty feet. The pretty feet. Anna Gunn. So, Anna, was this Post really... Post-coital. Yes. Post-coital. <laughs> was this acting or was that really a heated floor? Uh, that was some acting. That floor <laughs> wasn't heated, yeah, I don't that, believe. That, that was, was a little acting. I believed it. Acting. I it's an old acting much. exercise, you know, to pretend that the hard. floor is heated. That's right. It's another Stanislavski Fred, Fred thing. Fred Stanislavski yeah. told me. <laughs> hey, cousins. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> There's Chris Cousins, who's an excellent actor and uh, always fun to work with. We enjoyed it. Ain't to too bad to look at coming out of this chest. No. <laughs> no, at some point he's going to grow hair on his chest as well. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that was a little jealous comment there. Yeah, really. Hmm, <laughs> Christian. <laughs> And, and Chris, in real life, is a is a very accomplished uh, painter. Yeah, an amazing painter. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. he yeah. is. He, uh, yeah. I mean, as in he sells his stuff for many thousands of dollars. Yeah, wow. yeah like $25,000. Well, that's right, many tens of thousands. Yeah. yeah. We shouldn't be paying him as much as we are then, should we? <laughs> yeah, if I had known that, yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's a good guy. There's the uh, young, uh, young master R.J., R.J. Mitty. That's his, oh, that's, his D, Mitty. that's his DJ name. <laughs> Young Mr. R.J. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Yeah, very, very sweet guy. Yeah. Great job as always. He's, this is a he's favorite shot. Grown right? yeah. I love this. Oh, oh, yeah. I, love, I love this shot. <laughs> and then what Brian did, that just happened to happen. What? what? So, With the clothes? He, yeah, well, you'll see when he opens the door again. Uh, yeah, right, like oh, right, right, right. Yeah, we're coming up yeah. with the with the uh, the Looks thing. Like he's got like a tutu hanging on his head. Behind my back. And there's uh, Bob Odenkirk. Uh, the show's there. starting. And uh, <laughs> the show's starting. And then Aaron. The show about obviously. the lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Well, it's a show about a lawyer <laughs> and some other people. Thank That's... God. Why did they wait so long? About the lawyer who's tr genuinely trying to help drug dealers. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what I'm going to do. The good hearted lawyer. <laughs> and the lovely, the lovely Aaron Paul, of course. You went ahead and did it anyway. Because I never said I want to cook it. Because it ain't yours. It's ours. Plural, bitch. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. I love how upset he is. The so one thing he remembered from high school. Plural. <laughs> plural, bitch. <laughs> he actually was able to use in real life. <laughs> cow houses. Oh, that's the greatest line. Cow house. Where the cows live. <laughs> <laughs> You, you never know which ones are going to okay, raise. Okay, ready? <laughs> or getting all testicular. Here we go. Oh, yeah. There it is. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that was very nicely done. Uh, was the, that a mistake or was the that? The indignity. No, I did that. Oh, uh, they're very well done. Do you usually clench your butt cheeks in a certain way to hold on to it? Is it? I, as I am right now. <laughs> <laughs> Now was this was this a shot at night and it's a day scope? Is it? 
or, or was that a specially shot that they used? You know, that's a good question. I think it was no. shot at night. This um, part right here. This this yeah. one shot mm -hmm. though. Then they shot it. This we had a special guy do this. We had a special. So this really uh, was infrared. That that one shot. Yeah. Them? Oh, okay. I think so. I don't want to say something wrong. I, let's just go with that. Well, it let's sounds go good. <laughs> it was either that or we shot it during the last uh, waning uh, daylight moments, and then we treated it to make it look like it was infrared. But it might actually have been infrared. I can't remember. I but but uh, Moyer, you were obviously here. Uh, on this day, yes. and where was this so shot? I think I would remember. This was shot um, in a in a park, an actual campsite, um, quite a ways away, out in the outskirts of town. Right by the Rio Grande, there, right by the river, is it correct? Yeah. yeah, close by, and and you know we created everything. It was empty, so we put all the RVs and all the. They did an incredible job yes. dressing it. Of course, uh, Stephen Michael Quezada, who plays Gomez, and of course the lovely uh, Dean Norris, and who plays the Hank. Trees and everything. Yeah. Oh, great that lighting. That looks great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Love Hank. Love Hank when he's on the case here. Mm -hmm. That was. This is obviously, you know, if you've seen the episode, and I imagine you have, if you're now listening to the audio. Uh, but uh, this was obviously our same RV, right? We didn't get a second RV here because this is not our RV story-wise. Or is that correct? I can't remember, Moira. Do you know? Yeah, it is not our RV, but it is a close. But I mean, did we use know. did we use ours for it, even though it was supposed to be a different one? Uh well. <laughs> Such a great shot. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I'm sorry. I'm I mean, momentarily uh, distracted. Oh, hey. <laughs> These guys, great. they were so game. They did such a... This is uh, Michael McCormick and Kathy Rose Center, who play Ma and Pa Kettle there, and they were so game, as you just said, Moira. They did such a good job. Yeah. It's amazing that you have those names right at the tip of your tongue. I know. Isn't that I mean, amazing? It's just, you, it's like a, a seed. beautiful it's, memory. I have, I have a steel trap for a mind. I have to as an executive Steel producer. trap. Mm -hmm. No, they did <laughs> I'm referring to this uh, wonderful print that they have in front of me. But it, uh, <laughs> but they were very nice folks, and they uh, they did it. And they were very, they, they went for it there. Good good folks did a great job. He's cool. All right, I tell you what. I'm going to check out a couple more, then we're going to call in the morning, okay? What do you say? Can't. Got to get home. You leave your balls in your wife's purse or what? Got to pack. Where are you headed? Texas. Yeah. Stephen does a great. I love. I love he, how Stephen plays this moment. I love that man. He's a yeah. great guy. I mm. love the Splenda <laughs> packets again. Back to so, yeah. memory <laughs> ritual. Hey there. And this is uh, very often we'll shoot on, uh, you know, in a sets built uh, on our sound stages. This is actually a real house. Uh, all of this, even the the be the bathroom and all of that. Uh, Wonderful yeah. folks who uh, who we rent it oh, from, yeah. who uh, we rent Hank and Marie's house from, and it's tough shooting in a real place because on a set you can fly walls, meaning you can you can take walls literally take the the fake walls out and move the camera in, move all the crew in. But in a place like this, you got to shoot on a real location, and you're obviously limited. But uh, luckily, this is a very well designed house and has got some room in it. And it's got to be harder for Michael too, a lot harder oh, for man. lighting. Michael Slovis, yeah. Absolutely. But keep it feeling now we're like up to the, the same show. Absolutely. Does a great we're job as always. Two naked men so far. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. And a lot of naked yeah. women. This is, oh, look this at is the fleshy Dean. episode. Yes. All wet. And Dean, uh, Dean, method actor that he is, he insisted on actually being naked for this scene. Really? Yeah. Wow. And we said we're never going to pan below the waist, but or tilt below. And he said, no, i got to be naked. So... To all of our chagrin. But he says that in every scene. <laughs> he does. <laughs> yeah. How is that different? Clothes are always put on him in post. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we saved money on this scene, actually. We didn't have to actually put the clothes on him digitally. Yeah. Biggest expense. People don't know that. Filmmaking. <laughs> That's right. You know that you can talk to me about things, right? You don't have to he does a great job here, and, and obviously uh, the wonderful uh, Betsy Brandt. Both, both. Uh, yeah, this whole season, or th this season for these two characters is a, 
it's just the greatest. Yeah. It's an amazing yeah. I made a decision. I'm like journey. I love this. Yeah, very well played. I would like... Oh, I know, I know. A condo in Georgetown, I know. If you would let me finish... Poor angry I'm Hank. Yeah. <laughs> I'd like to be... Suffering from his uh, post-traumatic stress and... Mm-hmm. Yeah. You worry about my career. My career's just fine. Did you not want to go? I don't blame you. I just... You late for work or something? I mean, after what happened last time, it would make perfect sense for you to not want to go back. I'm on to some important stuff. So right talk about right Johan a little, uh, Moira, <laughs> working with Johan. You, <laughs> you've worked with him twice now, is that twice. correct? Twice, yeah. Johan is a blast. He's just, he's a delight. He's inventive. He's nonstop energy. The crew loves him. He actually manages to inspire everybody by screaming yeah. in, in his own very hysterical Swedish way. <laughs> He's like, come on! Come on, you people, you're killing me! Let's go! Yes. And, 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 and awesome you, know, you love him for it. He's great. And when he loves something, he says, it's awesome. Yes, yeah, awesome. awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. It's awesome. <laughs> awesome. Check him out on YouTube. Brian, that was awesome. Awesome. Yeah. In his band? Yeah, check, yeah, his check him out on great. YouTube. It's Are a, they? Yeah. Uh, Stockabo. Stockabo? Yeah. Stockabo, yeah, which means Stockholm boy, I believe. Stockabo. Stockabo. Check him out on YouTube. And it's also, um, wasn't that song that we used, the rocket scientist song in the strip and, club? Scene? In the that strip club, yeah. It was in the uh, on all the, the TVs in the background um, as well. Yeah. Um, but yeah. That was, that was a friend of his? That wasn't his band? That, yeah. that, it Wait, was that wasn't his band. That, that wasn't was... his band, but the video. Remember, they kept replaying his his video um, over and over again. But yeah, yeah, one of his music videos. I I didn't notice that. All I saw were boobies. <laughs> but I'll take your word for it. His, his brain shut down. The boobies <laughs> were a little boobies. distracting. Yes. Boobies. boobies. Here's a couple boobies <laughs> on the screen right <laughs> now. <laughs> boobies. <laughs> <laughs> Giancarlo Esposito, That's what right. a terrific actor. Yeah. What a great find and a great catch yeah. for our it's show. It's true. It's true. You guys are so good in this scene. I love, I love, uh, I just love this scene. I love the way Moira wrote it and I love the way you play it and Giancarlo plays it. This man is so yeah. <laughs> deluded. <Just match>. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. the, 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 what's, what's great about it is that, and I, we, 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 we have found one of uh, Vince's favorite words, inscrutable. He likes oh, to yes. write inscrutable. Yes. And the other one is, uh, he'll write in the script is, wow. all right, talking about this or some such. He'll say some <laughs> such. Some, some such. such, like et cetera. We've all, we've some adapted. Such is and it's a, and, and, but he has, you found the perfect, look at that inscrutable face. That's you true. have no idea what he's thinking That's or true. feeling. Yeah. That's true. And poor Walt is anguished going through this trying to find some iota of understanding of where what he's thinking and feeling. That's true. I'd like to show you something. You guys are so good together. I think Walt wears all that on his face and <laughs> and Giancarlo wears nothing. Yes. You know. Mm-hmm. Oh, Gus wears this nothing. woman walking past right. here yes. was our contest winner. That's yes. Right. Oh, yes. yes. Lovely. She made that great video. Yes. Doing yes. the Walt monologue. She sure. did a fantastic job. She was a very sweet lady. Jane, right? Jane. 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 Yeah. Jane. Jane. Yes. Yeah. Jane. Yeah. She was really sweet. She very was fun. Did an excellent job with her video. And uh, she's a very sweet lady. Yep. Yeah, she sent me a it's bunch a of pictures that she took on set that day. Such a sweetheart. What is the video? It, she did a video. It was a video contest, and we had so many excellent, excellent entries. Uh, so many, It was very, very hard. I wanted to pick more than one winner uh, because yeah. there's so many great ones. But she did this amazing video with a, with a, a, a big desert tortoise, like uh, uh-huh. the one that uh, uh, Tortuga's head was on top of. And right. she, she was dressed up in Tyvek, and she was in, a, in, a, in an RV. And <laughs> wow. She did a great, did really a great job. She really went for it. Is it on YouTube? Yeah. I believe it is. Probably. I believe Good. it is. What is did it? she do a scene from the show? Is that what it was? Or no? I, think she did, I think she did the opening pilot scene. Yeah. Right? Yes. Yes, That's she did. Right. Yes, yeah. she did. Did an excellent job. She was in her underwear. <laughs> 
Isn't there a picture of her in her underwear? In like tidy whitey. She's whitey? a teacher too. Yes, and she's, she's a, a science teacher. We're, we're now she's getting her in deep trouble. <laughs> <laughs> I know. But she was great. It's a fireable a, offense. She, you know. she did an excellent job. She's a very sweet. She lady. did. Yeah. And I think she had a really fun time on the set. And we, yeah. We put her in the scene, and yeah. she hung out all day. And you just saw Christopher Cousins, uh, Ted, drive up in his shiny black BMW, which is actually the personal car of uh, Stu Lyons, our, our wonderful <laughs> producer, which tells me I'm paying him too much. <laughs> but uh, Stu very nicely let us uh, borrow his car. And, uh, Here's a, one of our little babies. Oh, nice yeah. shot. One of the many yeah. babies. We, we've used... Uh, How many babies have we had so far? It was funny. We were talking oh, about gosh. that in another one of these audio commentaries. Yeah. That We've used uh, dozens and dozens of them. Probably a different one for every scene. Sometimes more than one for an individual scene, if it's a long scene. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. 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 Well, we always try to hire uh, twins or, or two babies at a time because you never know. If one is going to be fussy during a scene that you can't, that's true. You can't have it. You know, that's so true. Swap them out. Yeah. But there's Hot also very, very uh, stringent laws right. on, on twelve murder. minutes and at when, a time. Yeah. 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 And at twelve minutes, you have, to, you have to scream at them. You're fired. <laughs> yes. From the time. That, as soon yeah. as you hit twelve minutes. Twenty minutes total. Twelve from the minute. Something. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Okay. Under, under the light. And then, <laughs> and then back in the box. And then back, back in the, the box, box. <laughs> but, but the, we provide air holes. <laughs> yeah, there's I air mean, holes. Yeah, like, right. I mean, it's not sag, like it's sag not like makes you put those air holes and sag and cysts. Oh, they're very, and, yeah. and they they're stringent on the diameter of oh, the yeah. air holes. Oh, yeah. All that stuff. Oh, yeah. Yes, to do it right. It's all strictly <laughs> mathematically derived. The baby must be able to breathe. Yes. Uh, I love uh, the sign that says science. Science. We, we did not put so that now, up. Yeah, that's just there. This is the fir this is, is Walt's this first, first visit. Oh, this is my first this visit. Is Walt's yes. first visit. Yes. Yep. And he doesn't know what this he's is, doing here. He didn't even know. This is a complete Dave shock to him. Like, yeah. I don't even drive know what him is somewhere happening. to yeah. kill him. Yeah. 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 Could be anything could happen. But so I, I as a character, I I felt somewhat better once I realized all these people were around. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, okay, well, I don't think Johan he's going to... Johan did a great job. Yeah. Look at all these great shots. And yeah. this is also a real uh, industrial laundry yeah. facility that it we is. use in Albuquerque. Yeah. Yeah. Functioning facility, and in fact, all the extras are actual employees. Yes. Because yeah. we really wanted yeah, yeah. it to look like mm -hmm. They knew what they were doing. And those oh, that, those are actual that. soiled diapers that are in the, in the washing machine. <laughs> now here's our, our uh, stretch of the truth. Actually. Yeah, talk talk about this. Talk about how you do now, this. Now, uh, actually, on the back of this, the 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 conceit is that that's where this the is good acting our layer up. is. Yeah. Going. You see how he? Yeah. See, <laughs> watch this. What he's is this? stepping Same down. Brian. Now watch as yep. I step down. I look at it as a long staircase, my... right? No. Yeah. Look at this. There's actually <laughs> There's nothing there. there nothing was there. The old just... joke of actually going downstairs behind the thing. <laughs> yeah, That's just what like... we were doing. Yeah. Didn't they make it look great? They did. Yeah, you did great. a really That's good job. Veteran acting. That's mm -hmm. That's... Both of you guys. And then so you're all the big jammed moment. up underneath there. Yeah. Your new lab. Where, where Walt's like, what the hell? Yeah. Your new lab. This is like. Toyland to Walter White. Yes. Hence, yeah. hence the wonderful music. I let love the, the subtle. Just... Let the intoxication begin. Yes. Wonderful. Uh, that is great music. It is, isn't it? It's a wonderful piece of... Uh, yeah. Uh, it's a, it's a pre-existing uh, song that Thomas Goljevich, our music supervisor, found for us. I, I don't remember the artist, but it's a wonderful piece of music. And uh, we are so... All... Oh, the meth you'll make. This is seduction, yes. Seduction oh. scene. Yeah. <laughs> Dr. Seuss's follow-up. Yes. It really is a seduction and, scene. And Brian, I think you had a consultation right before this with our DEA consultant, didn't you? And we got we started to understand about thorium oxide beds. Thorium oxide. What that would mean. Yeah. For a catalyst bed. <laughs> Look at this. Yes. This reaction bed. This is, of course, uh, an amazing uh, set built on a soundstage, a two-story set. Uh, the walls, which look like uh, uh, press form concrete, are actually, uh, I don't know, you know, I probably, probably get a lot of this wrong, but it's, it's just uh, wood, sort of a wood uh, paneling with a, sort of a plaster job over it. Uh, all the, uh, the spiral staircase was all built uh, in-house by uh, uh, W. Gilpin and his amazing crew. 
And this, this is all record built. speed. Record speed, I mean, they, yeah. They, they just did a remarkable job. Yeah, mm -hmm. as always. Amazing job. He's got such amazing craftsmen and women working for him. Uh, metal workers, welders, uh, plasterers, uh, carpenters, uh, and all of it designed by Mark Freeborn, our production designer, our excellent production designer, and, uh, and his great crew. I also wanted to point out that the sound quality is really terrific because it has that feeling of being in a well, yes. just slightly, so yes. you feel the surroundings. And we are actually, of course, on flat ground, on flat surface, yes. but it feels like we're in that. And so kudos to our production recording and uh, post-production. Right? Exactly. Our, of course, uh, Daryl, who records uh, our on-set stuff, he and his guys do a yeah, great job. Terrific job. But that little sound of a well is probably also... Uh, it's Daryl. Daryl's job to get us uh, clean sound, which is a very tough job, especially in a lot of circumstances when we're outdoors with traffic and whatnot. And then in post-production, uh, uh, Jeffrey and Eric, our, our mixers, uh, they they add in a little bit of uh, reverb, uh, mm -hmm. whatnot, a little echo. They they do just wonderful work. It's a definitely group effort, as is everything on this show. I do think that when the uh, outline for this episode came out, everybody saw the word Super Lab in capital letters. Yeah. There was collective panic. Yeah, yeah I imagine. Yeah. <laughs> they had to do the task ahead. <laughs> I love the way you two guys play this scene. Yeah. Just great. What's, what's really interesting and what I enjoy about working off him is that we're, we're sort of mirrored images of each other. Mm -hmm. There's a certain amount of, of respect that the characters have for each other, mm -hmm. and yet yeah. our approach is completely different yeah. to it. And, and Well put. Yeah, and Gus knows how to play into your mm -hmm. commonality. It was a good point, Moira. This is a seduction scene. He oh, know, it is. He knows just what buttons to push and yeah. walk. Look, look at that. He's getting to him. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Great job. I love mm -hmm. that scene. Yeah. You guys here, here, so here's a lovely Miss Gunn again. Ms. Ms. Gunn. Look at those baby blues. <laughs> Conflicted yes. Skylar. Yes. You could uh, grab a quick bite. Uh, Maybe she's gotten over there. That place around the corner is pretty good. <laughs> I think she's thinking of Walt she right does. now. She's like, for <laughs> sure. That's, that's oh, the... Oh, yeah. And she misses her own bathroom with... Half the accoutrement. <laughs> yeah, it's like uncomfortable to her feet now. I think that's that's. that's right. It burns. It's searing. It's burning my flesh. It's aggravating all this yeah. luxury. It's the heat of guilt. I love our meals and the setup for them and <laughs> the traditional. Yeah. The white family meals. Yeah. What do you guys eat in there? How, how, do you guys have to eat over and over again for each of these uh, scenes? Yeah. I, it, yeah, but that's why we're very spare about it. Yeah. Very <laughs> judicious. Yes. I'll take one bite in the master. Yes, exactly. And that's it. <laughs> Multitask. Uh, see, that's why I like I like to eat during scenes. Do you? <laughs> I do. But what if it's take twelve or whatever, and you got to yeah. match? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you're only taking one or two. Yeah, bites you're taking a couple bites. The there whole, she goes. Yeah. You can see. And then you like you all vomited up later. Brian was just spitting his food. <laughs> yeah, I, I just that wipe of the mouth was actually spitting yeah. the food into actually, the napkin. You can't, you can't see. I there's a little the pile feet. of napkins yeah. under the table. That's right. Right. Yeah. Yeah, the actual baby. This is very nicely played. There was a nice because you I'm, never know when the baby's going to make sound, and you know Brian and Anna were so in the moment. The baby did make sounds, and they both just reacted and yeah. lived it. That's it right. Really very often yeah. a baby would not be here for a scene like this, but because you yeah. like there nice was reaction. there was dialogue here, was there not? Uh, 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 originally, uh, Moira. And there is, and, yeah, and she says, there is. "Do you want to?" No, yes, there is, right. but but there was this a big moment. But there was originally yeah. a lot more dialogue, and I think we all realized that you two, uh, 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 Brian and Anna, you're so good here, and you get everything you need from the scene just by your looks to one another. That yeah. there was a there was mm. probably oh, I see. a paragraph or two of dialogue that we realized we just didn't need. Mm. Yeah, 
Because we were, you guys we were run into that the a lot. <laughs> <laughs> it really is true, though. You do. It, yeah. it, it, uh, it does happen a lot. Look, that's a beautiful shot. That's a I great shot. That really is. And well, there's something the about that. time yeah. that Skylar's let Walt hold the baby yeah. since all the descent. It's a big deal. It's true. That nice shot from outside, you know, you yeah. really see that. Yeah. Outside you can the, just yeah. see. Look, we have the same kind of head. <laughs> Yeah, my child. It's not Look Ted's baby. <laughs> See that? <laughs> Bro, he knows. <laughs> Again, I think that's what the brilliance of... Oh, look at these. These are terrific. Those are awesome. Aww. This is down... That's downtown Albuquerque. Uh-huh. This is all Albuquerque. Yeah. These are purpose shot for uh-huh. us by a couple of great guys who do these great time lapse with a still camera, just a digital uh, like Nikon or Canon still camera. Do great, great work. And the, the process of that is they set it up on a on a tripod, okay. and it the shot goes off once every how often? It could be uh, whatever they set it to once every five seconds, twelve seconds, twenty, whatever. They they do the math and and they say we want this much uh, light change with the mm-hmm. sun going across the sky, but we only need it to be five seconds long. And right. of course, we're running at 24 frames a second all the time here, so 24 photographs will equal a second at a time. So they just do the math and they set it to whatever they, they want it to accomplish. Right. So it's a, a long, arduous task. I mean, they're out there yeah. all night long and all morning yeah. in order to get that. That's true. Few seconds, like three yeah. three seconds yeah. of film. It's true with a lot of people coming up saying, yeah. what the hell are you doing yeah. there, boy? <laughs> so that happens a lot, I imagine. But it's really become our, our signature mm-hmm. little way to move time. Yeah, that's true. I see other shows doing it too now, though, which irks me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At the feet of the master, Vince. Man, although we did not, we, we certainly did not, I don't propose that we invented time lapse photography. I just, uh, but we, we do like using it. This is also yeah. a practical location in downtown, and so the, the buildings you see outside are not backdrops, but actual buildings in downtown Albuquerque. That's right. This is a practical, what you call a practical uh, set or location. Yeah. I remember shooting outside of this building, and uh, and Lynn, one of our wonderful onset PAs, was locking down the street, and this guy was trying to walk through, but he was going to walk into the shot, and she she tried to stop him, and he just lifted up his shirt and showed a gun and said, "I'm going in," and just like walked past us. We're like, "Wow, that guy's oh intense." My God. Yeah. <laughs> wow. A good decision to let him go. Yeah, yeah exactly. Uh, yeah. I thought yeah. you were going to say, and then Lynn tackled him. Yeah, because Lynn, Lynn is all of, him. you know, She's, four foot 11. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> she could have taken him. <laughs> That's worrisome when that kind of stuff happens. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. This lady did a great job. She did a good job. She did a wonderful job. Mary Sue Evans. Way to go, Mary. Mary Sue is, uh, did a wonderful job there. So this is uh, Walt living in the baby's nursery. Oh. Uh, What could that be? Temptation. I love this moment. Yeah. I can't. Yes, I can. No, I can't. (laughs) This just shows the pure brilliance of Anna Gunn. (laughs) That thing was heavy, too, wasn't it, Anna? Or did you just play it? And her ample bosom. And her ample (laughs) bosom. Which we all Ample. enjoy. <laughs> and a gun, everybody. <laughs> and a, right. Oh. And a gun. There's, there's a breast wrangler on yeah. side. Yes, yeah. there is a breast yeah. wrangler they, on They've sets. become unruly. In yes. fact, they, they've become unruly. Yeah. Uh, they'll only be on screen for 12 minutes. <laughs> this is, this you is, have to get other breasts. A, a cadre of <laughs> <That's> all. <right. laughs> <laughs> they get breasts. tired of cranking. They get tired of cranking. They want to go hide away again. <laughs> That's right. Is this Julie? See, this is Julie. Yeah, this hey. is the first time we see Julie yeah. Dretson. 
Julie Dretzen, who is uh, in real life, is uh, Sam Catlin, one of our producer writers. Uh, it's uh, Julie is his wife. No, this isn't yeah. the first time. The first time was in the first episode uh, that we saw Julie in the episode oh, right. I directed. Yes. Yeah, that is correct. That is correct. Yeah, this her, is yeah. Right, right. And, Terrific job. Really. Yeah. yeah really. Right just there. So very really fun to play with her. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, everyone hears about Hollywood nepotism and how it gets people jobs. It did not happen in this case. Uh, no. She's just great. And so we hired her. As a matter of fact, I didn't know she was married, Sam. Yeah. And uh, I, I, in the in the audition tape, she's, yeah. oh, yeah. <laughs> she's fantastic. <laughs> no, but you know what's funny is that in the first episode that I directed, uh, in their first meeting scene, right. uh, Julie played a trick on Sam. She called him. And said, you remember this, Anna? She called him yes, and said... Yes, I put her up to it. Oh, you did? <laughs> yes. She called Sam and said... And he goes, hey, how's the shooting going? And she goes, well, it, it's better now. And he's going, what, what do you mean? I said, well, I... I don't know what I did to upset him, but Brian is screaming at me. And, I, I put her up to that. Yeah. And Sam is going, what? And he goes, yeah. he was really upset, and he was, scream he was screaming at me to, to I get started right. to cry. She started pretending to cry, and then Sam's going, oh, my God, what? Oh, my God. And then he heard me cackling in the background, I think. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good acting. Yeah. It comes into play all kinds of ways. That's hilarious. It was good. It was fun. I was only screaming inside. I never let it out. No, she was fantastic work. I do remember when we were watching the audition tapes and she was, you know, she was so great and it was so clear that we should cast her. And Tom turned to Sam and said, uh, no offense, but your wife is the scariest. <laughs> But see, I don't. We were looking for a formidable. Scare. You know. I didn't think she was I don't, scary. I don't see her that way, though. I no. see. I mean, yeah, no, I know he I said that, but I see her as just she's no nonsense, and she's giving good advice here. And of course, Anna uh, needed yeah. needed to be said. Anna, you're fantastic yeah. here. Again, and, uh, and it's just she needs good advice here, and 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 uh, but but uh, you know it's hard to take. Exactly, and I'm. And I'm, for the record, Anna was so sick this day, you guys. Oh, were you? If you remember oh, yeah. that, Anna. Yeah. You were so sick. Yep. You don't look you sick at all. Can't tell it. No. No, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't even know that. <laughs> you know, what, what really plants the, the character for, for Julie here, you're dealing with the nice juxtaposition between a woman who is dealing with all emotion and confusion and wondering what to do, and a woman who is dispassionate and, and professional. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and is giving Great. excellent advice. Yeah. By the way, this is our executive producer, uh, I guess this season, co-executive producer, uh, I'm thinking season four. But Michelle McLaren, our uh, wonderful producer, director, this is her office that uh, this scene yeah. is actually shot in at, stage. at Q Studios. This is, uh, this is just, they, she cleared out all her stuff and yeah. we shot here because we, we had nowhere else to shoot. And... Yeah. We often find those um, interesting opportunities when we realize, well, do we build a set? Yeah. Do we go somewhere? It's too costly. Right. We can do this right here. Right. And, Mm -hmm. And out the window, our, our greensmen put up some uh, uh, foliage, but otherwise you're looking out, I think it's, it's a the, parking lot. the parking lot of our Q Studios. Yeah. parking yeah. lot of our studios. Yeah. Michelle kind of scored, though, because now she has the nicest office. Uh, it's now true. she got paint. Yeah, exactly. It's true. <laughs> Away from Navajo white. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Everything Navajo. She, actually, yeah. she has actual drapes now. Yeah. Nobody else has drapes. I do have to say, I love the, the fact that, that Skylar, for the first time, has somebody to actually talk to about some of this stuff. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's true. That. An appropriate person yeah. to talk to. Yeah, yes. yeah exactly. Yes. Uh, it's, she even gets if to she, confess. Even it's if she confessing. doesn't yeah. like what she's hearing right. in response. Exactly. It's an outlet, finally. Yeah. yeah. Skyler's got a tough, tough, tough road this season, and, and this episode certainly is, is uh, shows, shows that uh, to great effect. She's... She loves her husband, but she's just understandably very, very angry at him uh, for what he's done, what he's putting the family through. But she understands on some level why he's doing what he's doing. But but it's it's just so many, so much back and forth. It's just tearing her apart. Mm -hmm. And and Anna, yeah. you, we see all that from your, you know, obviously even uh, when you're not, when the character's not speaking, we see it whether there's through dialogue or, or even better through just uh, silence. So. Well, it's so there's so many layers that that's, that are going on at the same time. It's really um, pretty delicious to play. Yeah, I say. this gives me chills. This mm -hmm. moment. Yeah. 
What a classy office. <laughs> Finally, <laughs> the show can begin again. Oh, there it is. There's there he is. There's the man. How is this lawyer going to help everyone? <laughs> 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 Yeah, he's, got, he's got his work cut out for him. <laughs> What's all That's thinking the, about everything? How is this good-hearted lawyer? That's the genius of this show. To the average viewer, they would not know it's about the no. lawyer. It's yeah. a subtle show. <laughs> it's subtle. Yeah, you have to be subtle. really keen. Hey, can we talk about your hair, Bob? Yeah, let's talk. I was just going to say the same let's thing. Let's talk. Talk about, about your on. hair, Bob. Look at that. Nice. He's he's got a nice comb over. <laughs> That's kind of obvious, kind of, kind of can see it, but maybe he could trick some people. And then he's got the um, mullet in back. Look at the mullet. There's the mullet. You yeah. can see it. Because Wasn't that, you know, that mullet was your idea, Bob. That was all your idea. It was all mine. Yeah. And they add that every day. Yeah, every day it comes in. That's right. And uh, it, it's just because he's um, he's still a very young guy. He's young, <laughs> viral, vibrant, viral, yeah. vibrant, vital, viral, yeah. all the V's. Yes. Man, yeah. <laughs> who's also very businesslike and yeah. very <laughs> mature. <laughs> He's got everything. Yeah. <laughs> He's probably got a jet ski that he's never used. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, One would hope. Yeah. <laughs> Business and fraud party in the back. Yep, that's right. That's look how, see, look how, look how Saul just makes sense out of all of this. Yeah. Right he's the only what guy in the whole show. Him? He's yeah. got his feet on the ground. Why is he dealing with these two assholes? <laughs> well, you got to feel for him. That's how the show gets you. I love that you're always wearing that ribbon. Yes. Yeah, because yeah, I was just gonna say that. <laughs> like he yeah. cares long after drumming up business. Else is, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Wait, Wayfarer 515. It still yeah. brings a tear yeah. to Bob's eyes. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and a potential client. <laughs> I knew I could count on you boys to play nice. That's that almost brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I've ever uh, said this before in one of these. I can't remember, but I'm gonna give a shameless plug here. Anyone who's not seen That's Mr. Awesome. Show. Uh, Bob's, uh. Bob's amazing. Bob uh, and and David Cross, his partner, amazing HBO show. You should check it out by all yeah. means. It's Thanks, serious. buddy. Okay. Yeah, it just they uh, are partners in life and partners in the show, and and we're here to celebrate that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're here in California to celebrate that. <laughs> Do you remember, Aaron, we had the this cute button on this scene where you forgot the money? Oh, yes. And then you came you back. Came back, and like storming it. in and That's right. grabbing it. Cut yeah. for time, I think, as, as is Cut often. For, yeah, it was, like an, it was an option that we couldn't yeah. resist. It was a it was great so option. Messy. Yeah. Hold on there. Oh, yeah, this is negotiation. This, this is yeah. so great. Yeah. Right this is so great. I'm in <laughs> and you're out. Yeah. <laughs> what a weasel. <laughs> And then here comes Saul. Well, you, you're going to need that money laundered, right? I mean, yeah, poor Jesse. 17%. That, that's a shade high. Now, let's this uh, rapid fire negotiation. That's nice round. Yeah, it's nice to see him get broken down this fast. Five. Cracks down right I, down. I love this coming up. Yeah. Look at that. Collapses. Five. He's being yeah. cut out. Yeah. Reasonable guy. This is short great. Term this is great. The three Ten right? even, but I can't go any lower and still respect myself. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> 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 like perfect nice. comic timing. It's it's perfect. The world, kid, and go with the winner. <laughs> <laughs> Cook whatever you like, as long as it's that ridiculous chili pea or some other dreck. Oh. But don't even think about using oh. my formula. You just try and stop me, bitch. And this it's is so fun to do right here. So cold. Oh, yeah, you yeah. got to really break a real windshield here. Yeah, got to pick this up. Gotta... Yay. How many Throw times it. you Perfectly guys do Perfectly, too, uh, Aaron. No, you, I mean, he nailed it. Yeah, and there, there was, there was uh, some lot, side but... betting going on with the crew. Um, yeah. Whether it was going to go all the way through or stick halfway in the windshield. Oh, yeah, yeah. Or if it was going to land in the plants. But we, people were really actually We had really so many cameras betting. going. We had three cameras. We had cameras everywhere. How many times did you break you it? Um, how many times did it? I think we just did it twice. What? Did we Didn't just we do just it once? Do it once because you nailed it. Okay. Right? Okay. We just and we, did we, it once. He okay. nailed it. We got the coverage. Yes? Hi there, uh, Mrs. Ortega? Yes. 
Hi, I'm Hank Schrader. This is Carol Gutierrez. Yeah. She does a great job here, Combo's mom. She's lovely. Yeah. yeah. Very nice. I love the way you wrote this, Moira, and I love the way this lady underplays it. I mean, you, mm -hmm. you could go for the sort of the model and the mawkish, oh, my poor dead son. And yeah. you, you feel her emotion, but she doesn't hit it. It's what I love about all you guys, all you actors on the show. You never hit it too hard. It's just always just enough, you know, because, you, you know, you don't need to put any extra stink on it. It's just, uh, the, uh, behind uh, Dean, you can't see it anymore, but in the earlier shot, there, oh, there, see there's a guy shaving another guy's head. When we were scouting locations through this really bad neighborhood, we saw oh, another it. guy shaving a guy's head out in the yard, and Johan, well, that was it. We just had to have it. <laughs> Everyone so. must get their head shaved. <laughs> yeah. Let's have the bang of a shave. <laughs> Production spent about four and a half hours to get that guy in the background there, didn't he? Yeah. Really pays off in this scene. <laughs> <laughs> I love those things. This is great. Yeah, yeah that's nicely Johan, done. That's, that's yeah. really his deal, too. Just a little, yeah, see, I never noticed that. I, you know, I hate to admit I it, it, I never did either, but Johan has such an eye for detail. He's so very he visual. He does. He's a very brilliant in, uh, director. In the previous season, when... <laughs> We had the whole meth selling montage, oh. you know, that winds up in the alley with Skinny P curtains. gets jacked. Yeah, wonderfully done. He really worked with wardrobe and created a lot of those people. Absolutely true. I this love so the sweet. attention to detail, our wonderful set uh, decorators. Uh, Good storytelling about who Combo was in his childhood room. Yeah. What was that on the bed? Was that a bunch of dried flowers? This is all the memorial. It's very historic. Um, it's like a cultural keeping of all that stuff in. <laughs> oh, I see. It's great. Memoriam. Yeah. She kept it all from She's the kept funeral. She kept it like a shrine. Yeah. A little oh. shrine. Yeah. So oh. sad. And Gwen Savage, uh, our wonderful uh, Albuquerque extras casting uh, person, who who uh, all the wonderful extras you've seen mm. uh, up to this point in our in our series, all due to her. Uh, mm -hmm. And her folks she had working for her. she she passed away unfortunately she passed away of cancer before this uh, episode finished and God she bless her, her. God we, we bless loved her. her she did a great wonderful yep. wonderful job for us for ever since the uh, the, the pilot I, I believe her. such and a we beautiful her. energy about her yeah she did it yeah indeed. Uh, God bless Gwen and uh, great job guys yeah. great Thanks job for watching, guys. Episode. thank great you episode, yeah. you thank guys. you.